What up y'all, it's PBJ back at it again with another video. So, Michigan Arms, Michigan State Arm Wrestling Championships are this Saturday. And unfortunately, I haven't posted for like the last two or three days-ish, but pretty much the whole month of May, I uploaded a video on this channel every single day. So, that is actually pretty awesome, all the new support, new subscribers. We recently just made it to 3,400 subscribers. So I wanna say thank you to everyone for all the support, all the likes, comments, shares, subscriptions, everything. Thank you so much. I also wanna shout out one of the members of the channel, a man with a yellow hat. Thank you very much for becoming a member of the channel. I appreciate it. So shout out, man with a yellow hat. But beyond all that, <laughs> Kind of want to make an update video, you know, let you know what's going on with me and kind of some of my thoughts leading up to this tournament. Overall, feeling the strongest I've ever felt in my entire life. I'm the biggest I've ever been. Um, it's arm wrestling. I'm always hyped for that. And um, basically, the only unfortunate part is, okay, pretty much everything that could have went wrong for this tournament, went wrong. So you can probably hear it in my voice. I'm actually a bit sick right now. So right now I'm in my rest week. So you dead week, rest week, um, where I don't train for an entire week before the tournament. Um, I don't lift any weights, no pull-ups, no nothing. On the day of, usually when I wake up, I'll do like one pull-up just to see like that everything's still, you know, good. And then uh, you know, head over to the tournament. And I'm sure you already know, but I do have a thumb injury that hurts pretty bad, thumb tendonitis in both my thumbs. And it hurts when I bend my wrist like this. It hurts when I, you know, go like this or like this. It, just, it hurts. Luckily, uh, my buddy Race, he put me on to a rehab. So I'm going to be doing that rehab leading up. And it felt good um, when I was doing it. So I'm hoping that the day of the tournament, I can actually compete at at least 90% of my strength, okay? That's all I ask for. If I can get my wrist bent without it hurting, like this right here hurts. So you can like literally, yeah, you can hear that. It's, it's messed up right now, but I think this is kind of symbolic though, because Everything that could have went wrong ends up going wrong for a tournament. It's my rest week, so I'm not even training this week anyway. So I, it's like the last mental test before this upcoming tournament that means a lot to me. I have been preparing for this tournament since the one last year. So for a long time, for an entire year, I've been preparing for this tournament getting bigger, getting stronger, getting smarter. I mean, I'm not even the same person I was at that last tournament. I mean, my hair is the longest it's ever been. Let me know what you think of my hair in the comments. By the way, I'm gonna keep growing it out. And overall, life is just much better than it was around that time. I go to the gym consistently. I even, trained, I even changed up the way that I train Meaning, instead of just doing my calisthenics, my pull-ups and dips every day, I switch to doing an actual workout split where I do push-pull legs, push-pull legs, rest. So every Sunday is a rest day. And it's been working wonders for me. That recovery aspect, being able to just train the muscles that I want to train, but harder. Um, still trying to figure out how to incorporate arm wrestling movements specifically in there. Um, what I ended up doing was I just arm wrestled on just random days of the split and just kept going. But, you know, unfortunately my uh, thumbs, they just uh, weren't very happy with what I was doing. So now they're injured, but I'm hoping I can recover this, these thumbs before the tournament. And if I can't, you know, I might still try to compete and just do bad and just, you know, just cause I love to arm wrestle, but um, what you call it. It's one of those things where I'm very excited though, overall. I mean, it definitely makes me a lot less excited to be injured because then I can't really push and give it my all and see the actual result 
you know, of how strong I really was and to be able to measure it up and compete with others because I do have that competitive spirit in me. But overall, feeling good. And as you may know, Joey's coming with me. Joey from the live streams and a couple of videos he's been in now. Um, I have very high hopes for Joey. He's going to be competing in the amateurs. And I have high hopes for Joey. I think that he's going to do really good. This is my prediction, you could say. I think he'll place top three in the amateurs, if not top one. Um, I think the things, you know, I don't want to expose too much just in case anybody in this class is listening. But I think the things... I think things will be interesting in that class depending on who's in it. You know what I mean? Uh, because he's going to go up against people that are going to be strong and, you know, they might know a little bit about arm wrestling. But granted, this whole time he's been versing me. So it might be one of those things where he's versed me so much that he just goes straight into the amateurs and just destroys everyone. That could very well be the case. And I realistically, that might just be the case. So you're in the amateurs uh 242 you better watch out because uh there's a threat coming your way <laughs> and uh as for me you know i'll be in the 220 because you know i'm 209 after all but with all that out of the way i do think that's about it for this video um just pretty much an update I don't feel good. <laughs> Overall, I don't feel good. I'm sick. Just trying to eat as much food as I can, be nice and healthy and recovered before this tournament. Trying to fix this, you know, thumb pain. Um, it's pretty bad. It hurts literally to bend my wrist. Either way, it's terrible. Um, but rehabbing it, hopefully. I mean, it's only Tuesday right now. I don't, I don't know if this video will be uploaded on Wednesday, but right now it's Tuesday. And I'm really hoping that you know, I'm mostly recovered by Saturday. I'm going to have to wake up early, a bit of a long drive, like two hours. So it's one of those things too, but it'll be hype because, you know, Joey will be riding along with us and he's having a great time talking strategy, getting hype in the car. I'm looking forward to it. It's just unfortunate that I'm sick right now, but overall, I am looking forward to this tournament. And that just goes to show, really, I don't really feel good at all, and yet I'm still hype. Still, I can smile knowing that I'm going to, you know, go there, have a good time, no matter what happens, win or lose. That's what I love about arm wrestling. But it's the feeling, you know what I mean? <laughs> arm wrestlers know, though. Arm wrestlers know. But, yeah, I do believe that's going to be it for this video. Uh, hope you enjoyed this update. Uh, if there's anything else that... I uh, feel the need to share before the tournament. I will let you know. You'll see it on the channel. Um, I'm sure I'll post it at least one more time. But uh, until that next video, I'll see you again. So like, comment, subscribe. And those two words I say at the end of every single video. Stay jacked. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.